but yes, I will be creating a Discord to uh, help with this um, virtual learning problem and uh, it's going to be for IS-34 uh, and it's going to be called Corona Central. I'm actually going to uh, stop paying attention and running my other server uh, for this one so Okay, next you have Instagram, and Instagram's useful for stuff with school because um, you can post like pictures and stuff to it, and pictures will work so that kids don't have to come in with their phones and take pictures of the board. So that's why it's useful, and now it's useful because they can't even come in with uh, and take a picture with the board. Another thing you may not have heard of is Twitch. So what Twitch is, is it is literally its sole purpose is for live streaming. And you do need OBS software for it, but which will basically give access to the Twitch account, but they won't do anything with it. Uh, I promise you that. And... Uh, you can basically stream in like a classroom and show students where it is. They don't need a code for it. Uh, you could make it private and you could invite people to it, but they're all pretty easy to use, uh, in my opinion. Discord, Instagram, and Twitch. So I, again, I will be making a Discord and I'm going to uh, not be running my other one except for EATS if you guys follow me on YouTube. Uh, so, yeah, I'm just going to be basically running uh, the Discord. Uh, uh, that's all I'm going to say. Those are all the tools that teachers can use right there that teachers may not have known about before, uh, but now you do. So that's all I have to say. Uh, thank you for listening. Uh, goodbye.